Hey, what's up guys? My name is Grady Eilig. I'm an embedded software engineer and welcome to my YouTube channel. And today we'll be reacting to a video called A Day in the Life of a Google Software Engineer by no one else but the tech lead, also known as the guy who says a lot of things as a millionaire. So anyways, this is my first reaction video, so let's get to it. All right guys, we got a lot to do today, so let's get moving. Uh, that's true. There's, there's usually, as a software engineer, you have plenty of stuff to do. There's, uh, there's just always something to do. Um, so if there isn't, you, you can just start developing things that would help the company, benefit the company, and uh, just make yourself productive all the time. One of the cool things about working at Google is that you have access to every one of their offices in the world. So today, I'm heading to the headquarters in Mountain View. I personally don't work for like a, such a big company, but uh, I'm sure there's like a bunch of benefits to it and, and I'm sure we will hear about these. So I, I think that's pretty cool to see. It's time to find some breakfast. This is really impressive. I mean, honestly, as, as probably as a software engineer for like, any other like smaller company, you would you would never see stuff like this. Like I mean, um, yeah, we we bring our own lunch. We I I pack my lunch at home, uh, or breakfast or anything like that. So I yeah I I don't see stuff like this. So this is the game room. I don't know if he still works there or not, but I bet you this is probably his first time going to the DDR machine. So since I don't have a desk here, I usually just find one of these empty meeting rooms that I can work out of. I'm going to get a bit of work done. Yeah, I, I used to work for a company and they, um, they had like a flex workplace. So you really didn't have an office space area or a table assigned to you. So you could go wherever there was like open seating. So I, I think that's a really cool environment and so on. But um, I, I don't know if that's the case in Google, but I remember having to struggle with not having your own desk and it was always a challenge like whoever gets there first and like you you gotta tackle your your like i mean not tackle but you gotta make sure you get your table like even though it's not really your table but if you take someone else's table you're just gonna have like some bad looks and like pe people usually know like who sits where so uh kind of tough and i'll see you again at lunchtime Okay, so he said, I'm gonna start working and I'll see you at lunchtime, but the time in the bottom says 9, 11 a.m. So that's, uh, that's, that's interesting. Uh, bowling alleys. You know what would be funny? If this comes out and it's actually like Saturday or Sunday, uh, like that he went to the workplace and he's like, oh, this is my regular work day, but like, I mean, people usually don't work weekends honestly the first few weeks you're here it feels like disneyland I, I i bet it does you know like you have so many perks and benefits that you can take advantage of and do uh, but uh, again you, you you probably need to do some work you know like you I, I don't think you have much time to like do all those things when you first start off uh, especially you got to prove yourself you got to show like you can you can pull off the load you got to do the work and everything um I'm just having a tough time that he's uh, he's showing this like this is oh this is a life as a Google software engineer that you just like sit in a meeting room for five minutes and then you can do whatever you want after that um, not not really actually I'm I'm pretty sure that's that's not very accurate. What they have a bowling alley? Dang, that's that's pretty impressive. Like uh, how how freaking cool is that? I mean. I, I allowed to bowl, like it's, it's a fun group activity. I haven't been able to do that for a long time because of COVID obviously, but man, this is, this, this looks really fun. Like there's another cafe I want to show you, which is uh, bigger. I wonder what's the time. He, he said he's going to work and we're going to see him at noon, but um, ever since he went biking around and just been running around on campus showing what the campus looks like. So it's a, it's a Google campus tour. Now, uh, now it's time to get back to work, do a little bit more, and then I'll see you next time at lunchtime. Okay, now he went to back to work, 
and we're going to see him again during lunchtime. So, but funny part again, he's on a bicycle. Like, I, I'd really want to see, like, you know, what, what does he actually do? Like, what kind of meetings does he have? Uh, do, what kind of code he's working with? Uh, how is that? Uh, do, does he collaborate a lot? And, like, what does it really mean to be a Google software engineer? So if, if you guys have a good video for that, um, that's, that's not a campus tour, then uh, let me know, let me know. And, and the location is nice too. It's right near San Francisco, so you have access to the city. You know, back there I was trying to get a cappuccino and they wanted me to wait 15 to 20 minutes for that. Over at YouTube, you can get it very quick. Real world problems here, you know. I had to wait like 15 minutes to get a coffee or something. Uh, that's, that's, that's a struggle as a software engineer, you know? I remember when I first joined the company, I would bike around this area during my orientation week and I'd be lost trying to figure out where everything was. Yeah, this, this is like uh, you, you start off a, a college. Again, the, the campus looks like really huge. Kind of reminds me of my college campus, you know? You, you start off there, you don't really know what is where, you use your Google Maps to find where it's like, oh, where's Thompson Hall or whatever your class is at. But um, I, I can see that being lost there and like trying to figure out where to go. It's lunchtime. Finally, finally lunchtime, 11.30. And uh, he's done zero, zero work. So um, that's very unfortunate. So. Please, if you start as, uh, as a Google software engineer and you think that the life is going to be like that, I bet you, I guarantee you, it is not. Uh, you cannot just slack around for 11.30 unless this is Saturday or Sunday when he's filming. Damn, those, that looks good. Like, it, it looks like legit good. Is it, out of curiosity, I, I don't know this. Maybe someone can comment me. Is, is the food free for there? Uh, employees like then anyone can just go and like get whatever they want or uh, or how is it do you do you guys know just just let me know in the comments section this literally like reminds me so much of a college campus you know um, on our college campus we would get food trucks as well and I think that was a, that was a really cool one you'd get some really good food from there clear but I've been having a lot of difficulty trying to focus today I'm gonna start wrapping Oh, having difficulty to focus today. I, I can see why, because you haven't done any work. You've been just like running around, showing off the campus. A lot of good campus content. So Google Campus Tour is the official video name, unless something changes here, which I doubt. This video up, there's, a, there's just one more stop we got to make. Head over to the Google store and buy some souvenirs. I'm not even surprised if Google promoted this. Um, promoted this video and gave, gave him money for it. You know, he, uh, it looks like he has a lot of views and, uh, and uh, a lot of uh, followers. So I, I wonder if it's sponsored by Google, so. So let me just show you guys quickly what I bought. It's a thermos, 24 bucks. It looks like he's just uh, showing off a bunch of Google merch you can buy at a Google store and uh, that's, that's really cool you can do that, you know, like you, you earn some points. A lot, of, uh, a lot of companies have these programs where you do like a survey or you, you might do like a health thing and you, you can earn some uh, money you can use within the company itself and uh, then you can uh, uh, spend it on some company merch. I, I, I worked for a company that did something like that. Just so you guys know, it's not all fun and games around here. Uh, I mean, I, I'm, I bet he's, I, I bet he's right. I bet he's right. It's, it's not all fun and games around here, but based on what he's been showing here, it looks like everything's all fun and game. But there is an exception. If you subscribe to my channel and you ever see me on campus, I might just take you out to lunch. Uh, <laughs> you can see in the bo bottom uh, right corner that there's uh, why I shouldn't have left Google as an ex-Google millionaire. So I'm, I bet he's not at Google, but uh, I wonder if the reason is because uh, he just, uh, uh, a lot of people like saw him on campus and he just had to take out everyone lunch and do, he didn't have any time to do any of his work. 
Uh, I don't know, but anyways, go, go ahead and uh, subscribe to Tech Lead and go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit the like button. Keep up the good work and I'll see you next time.